Okay, so today I'm going to be showing you a property on Maidenhead Road. For those of you who aren't familiar with Maidenhead Road, it is in a wonderful location, partly because it is so close to the town centre, but also you have the Welcome Hills which are on your doorstep. Uh, one of the beauties of this property is the amount of parking that you get with it, which is very rare to find, particularly when you are this central. Uh, now this is quite an interesting property because it was formerly a one house which has been converted into two maisonettes, a first floor and a ground floor. So I'm going to show you around the ground floor first. Now the interesting thing about this property on the ground floor, it's been very successfully run as a holiday let for the last sort of couple of years with a very very high occupancy rate. Um, so let me show you around. Uh, as you can see you're greeted into a really rather nice hall. Then you've got a shower room, bath here, now you've got two bedrooms in this one, so you've got master bedroom here at the front. I'll just swing around so you can see what else you've got. So nice thing about this, you've also got a little ensuite with this bedroom. So you can see there, you've obviously toilet, sink and then shower. So it's maximised the uh, space available here. You've got large double wardrobe as well. So this is at the front and then you go around to the second bedroom which is also a very good size double it's got a really nice feel this one obviously because you've got your own front door um you know it really is quite a, a special property you've got a lovely big double bedroom in here a uh, little cupboard here which is just got um perfect there's a little meter in there just great for little knickknacks and brooms and brushes and whatnots and then you've got this great big open plan living dining kitchen Got a light well here which obviously allows the room to be flooded with natural light. In terms of appliances you've got dishwasher, uh, oven, fridge freezer and then from here you've got a very handy utility room with your washer dryer and your uh, washing machine and then you've also got, uh, so both properties are on their own independent services, they've both got their own boilers, they're both gas centrally heated. Um, let me just swing around here so you just get a different vantage point. But as you can see, this is a really large space, lots of natural light here because you've got uh, both the sliding doors here and then a single door west facing. So you did this one property does come with a garden as well. In fact, they both come with gardens. This one's slightly larger than the other one, which I'll show you as we go outside. But again, just one last shot of this. So it's just been converted. What's nice about this is when you come in here, sometimes when you do these type of conversions, it sort of doesn't really work. But in this case, it absolutely does. It works perfectly. You've got, so you've got really good balance of both the living space here, but also the bedroom space. And every, what's nice, every single room you go into, uh, you've just got a nice feeling of space and balance to them. So even if you look at the hall, you know, this is the sort of thing you'd expect to find, uh, not typically in this sort of conversion. Uh, where they've had to rob space to gain, gain it elsewhere whereas this has got quite a nice feeling of space so that sort of concludes the ground floor i'll switch off now and then i'll do another video for the first floor okay so this is part two um where we're going to show you the first floor maisonette just to clarify how the parking is going to be broken down each maisonette is going to have two parking spaces each which is very very desirable but given how centrally located you actually are and probably with some clever maneuverability you might even be able to squeeze a bit more in uh, so like the ground floor this one has being a maisonette its own front door this is one on the first floor so let's go and take you in again like the ground floor this is a two bedrooms property which works ever so well so as we come up on the right hand side you go straight into your nice open plan living kitchen I'll just swing around just to give you a better idea so like the other one this has got its own boilers on its own services gas all in the property you've got space for fridge freezer oven hob and there's also a washer dryer set in the kitchen units then as you come through I'll go to the largest bedroom first so you've got this beautiful big master bedroom at the back of the property which is obviously ideal it's a very large bedroom this in fact really square footage wise you could probably squeeze into two if it had a second window but that gives you just some sort of idea of how big it is nicely kitted out as well with the D wall hung tv and uh, lots of storage then you've got your own ensuite to this one really nice space you've got four pieces in here you've got a large walk-in shower but you've also got the benefit of a bath so ticks all the boxes and then the second bedroom doesn't also disappoint either that's also a really nice size let me just swing around 
So a comfortable double room. Again, like before you've got the built-in cupboards. So you've got lots of practical elements to this apartment. And straight ahead of us here, this is where the boiler is in this cupboard, which is a Worcester Bosch boiler. And then last but not least, you've got this large sort of shower room with walk-in double shower. So both the bedrooms can be independently serviced with their own space. So again, like the other one, it does come with a garden, this one, but it hasn't been finished yet. So we'll have to add something on later on pictorially. Uh, but wonderful location right in the centre of the town with two parking spaces. It's a real find. So if you want any more information, please get in touch.